sucks in politics. I know, right? not draw any heat on us, Bato. Cool it! I'm taking heat! Guys, my phone just got infected. Uh, impossible. We put Josh levels of security on it. It's definitely possible. Says it's the Zombie 2 virus. You do know who made the first zombie worm, right? Haddock. Yep. Who is Haddock? Bay Area legend. This guy was exposing government deals with defense contractors while we were still in school. Haddock's been off the map for a decade, but if he's back, I mean, wow. What's the virus doing? Looks like it was first installed through a spoof CTOS mobile update. I can see some of the phones it infected before mine. If I track them back, maybe I can find the source. Let's see if we can figure out Haddock's game here. Can you isolate the worm on a virtual machine? I would love to. Send it over.
Josh, I found another zombie-infested phone. Does it have CTOS mobile on it? Yep. Got another zombie bite. Nice. I'm starting to understand part of its process. It's trying hard to spread through infected access points. Why? I don't know yet. It's definitely had it, though. This is organized a lot like the first zombie code, even though the systems are totally different. Damn. What is he up to? I'll keep looking. Zombie attack from CTOS Mobile again, so I think we can confirm the delivery method. Josh, send in the dump to you. Wait a minute. I think I know what the zombies are up to. Yeah? They're infecting other vulnerable phones in close proximity, faking access points to hook in more victims where they can. He's searching for specific keywords, most of them related to Graystrom and military defense technology. He's building his own little spy network, huh? Does all that data end up somewhere? This is Haddock. Yeah, he'll be untraceable that way. But 
All three of these phones got their update from the same access point. I'm gonna go find it. I'll work on a cleaner. Wait, do we want to clean it? Yes. I'm a fan too, but... This is gang territory. Haddock's working with gangs now? No. Haddock wouldn't work with gangs. How do you know? Because the alternative doesn't make any sense. He wouldn't. Maybe there's more to it. Not even close, baby! I don't think this is about gangs at all. This is smart. Going to fill us in? Soon. I got a hunch. What you got there? None of your business. Who gave it to you? Some guy. Fuck off. A guy with the name? Maybe. Didn't get it. What do you care? It's uh, stolen. So? Hey, hey, you can keep it. I just need to find the guy who gave it to you. What does he look like? Where's a lot of black? Hoodie. Awesome. Gray hair poking out. Tell. Look real slow. Ooh. 
That's all? No. He has a little mole next to his dick named Leslie. What the fuck, man? He just handed me a phone, said it was a gift. I didn't take a blood sample, for fuck's sake. Who the fuck are you? Well, what the fuck do you want? Nothing, man. It's cool. Found a bite zero on a homeless guy. Haddock gave him the phone. The man's playing a smart game here. He even picked a guy who camps out right next to a gang hideout so people wouldn't come look. Um, question? Why a homeless guy? Because he knows the guy will easily spread the zombie virus. Think about it. He goes to mass transit places to beg for money. Because he knows the guy will easily spread the zombie virus. Think about it. He goes to mass transit places to beg for money. I bet if we track the first infection points, they map his daily route. He's spreading it like a biological virus. Exactly. By the way, he left me a nasty little message. He wants us to back off. Back off? But I've already got the cleaner ready. It's going to spread fast and clean Zombie 2 off of any phone it reaches. Should I launch it? It's going to cause us too much trouble if we don't. We'll have to live with Haddock being sore about it. But let's keep an eye out for a way to make it up to him. He would be a strong ally for Dead Sec.